Hello guys. Hope all of you are doing well. This is Showman from Oil and Gas Field Quality Control. Very interesting subjects. Maybe most of you have never walked in this field, but I had a chance to work with hot tapping. This is our subject today. Let us start to discuss. There are both pros and cons for hot tapping pipeline. It is important to consider both sides before choosing this method to your piping system. In general, hot taps are done in a piping system, but it can also be done on the pressure vessels, storage tanks to add nozzles. Hot tapping is highly dangerous operation. Therefore, hot tapping must only be used as the last resort when it is impractical to shut down the system. While preparing a hot tapping specification, care needs to be exercised in inspection, design and testing. It must be ensured that this operation is done in a safe and reliable manner. Each hot tapping needs to be properly designed. The location of hot tapping thoroughly inspected and the installation procedures reviewed before starting the operation. Here you can see split T how it is getting fit on the pipeline. Fluid is not contact with the reinforcement sleeve. The top half of the reinforcement sleeve and there is a bottom half of the reinforcement sleeve. Both are fit over the pipeline where the branch connection to be welded. We will discuss in detail. Here are some ways of hot tapping. These photos are self explanatory. You can go through these, you can understand before cutting a line how the pressure on the line still continues and we are doing the hot tapping and installing the branch connection. Some basic questions when we are talking about hot tapping. Is hot tapping applicable for all types of pipeline? Hot tapping can be applied to various types of pipeline including those carrying oil, gas, water and chemicals. However, specific factors such as material, diameter and operating conditions should be considered during and planning phase. Are there any size limitations of hot tapping? While hot tapping can be performed on pipelines of various sizes, there may be practical limitations depending on the equipment and the available space for installation. Consulting with experienced professionals can help determine the feasibility of hot tapping for specific pipeline sizes. Can hot tap be performed on pressurized pipeline? Yes, hot tapping can be performed on pressurized pipeline and it is being performed on pressurized pipeline. The procedure includes implementing pressure control measures and ensuring the integrity of the connections during the tapping process. How long does a hot tapping operation typically take? The duration of a hot tapping operation depends on several factors such as size of the cut and complexity of the pipeline and the specific requirement of the project. It can range from a few hours to several days. What is the purpose of risk assessment in hot tapping? A risk assessment is conducted to identify potential hazards associated with hot tapping operation and to determine the necessary precautions to mitigate those risks. It helps ensure the safety of personnel and the integrity of the system. Why it is important to have a qualified welder? A qualified welder with expertise in welding joints is crucial for the hot tapping process. They possess the necessary skills to perform welding tasks safely and effectively, ensuring the integrity of the newly added connection. What shall be done before performing hot tapping? Based on my own experience, we have to check hot tapping locations for roundness, defect or any lamination or record them. Check the actual pipe wall thickness because hot tapping has some wall thickness range requirement to be considered. Check actual operation pressure and temperature when you want to do the hot tap. This will help confirming the integrity of the main pipe when you do the cutting. Check the actual fluid velocity when you want to do the hot tap. This will help you to ensure cutting coupon won't be lost after the cutting. Check review hot tap fittings selected with vendor. Check and review hot tap machine required space in case you are in a limited area. In case you have never done it, when it is critical 
then mock up is highly recommended to help you understand and confirming several things welding wps it needs to be confirmed and approved the qualification of wps during hot tapping is little bit special and different as compared to other piping wps that one i will discuss in a separate video with you to have a clear idea oil penetration depth to ensure pipe integrity when you do the hot tap welding highest temperature and the main pipe strong and good enough to go through hot tapping process as designed test your block valves and other components are good to go brief hot tapping procedure in a sequence first welding the split tip fitting a split tip fitting or the half reinforcement slips is meticulously welded onto the pipeline at the desired location of the new branch connection installing the valve following the welding process a specially designed valve is installed onto the split tip fitting it is sometimes termed a sandwich valve drilling the hole once the valve is securely in place the drilling process commences a specialized drill typically operated remotely from a control panel located outside the pipeline closing the valve after the hole has been drilled the drill is removed and the valve is closed the step is crucial as it allows the branch connection to be made while maintaining the flow of the pipeline the closed valve prevents any leaks or spills during the subsequent connection process connecting the new pipeline section with the valve securely closed a new pipeline section is attached to the valve completing the branch connection the seamless process ensures the continuity of the pipeline's operation without causing any downtime or disruptions let us discuss the parts of the hot tap machine stopple a proprietary device to be used in conjunction with a hot tap that blocks a hot line is called stopple A typically hot tapping system consists of tapping fittings, isolation valve, hot tapping fittings which includes the cutter and housing. The drilling machine and cutter. The drilling machine usually consists of a mechanically driven telescopic boring bar that controls a cutting tool. A pilot hole in the pipeline wall is bored by the cutting tool in order to center a hole saw that cuts out the coupon. fittings connection to the existing pipeline is made with the fittings which can be simply welded nipple for a small that means 1 inch connection to a larger pipeline or a full encirclement split sleeve t for extra support when the branch is the same size as the parent pipeline the t wraps completely around the pipeline and when welded provides mechanical reinforcement of the branch and carrier pipe valve the valve on a hot tap connection can either be a block valve or a control valve for the new connection and must allow the coupon section of pipeline wall cut out by the drilling machine to be removed after cutting operation suitable valves include a wall valve or gate valve but not a plug valve or a butterfly valve So that's all for the hot tapping introduction to you guys. Hope you gain some knowledge through this. If you like the way of my teaching, please do not forget to share and subscribe my channel and do not forget to hit the like button to inspire me more. Signing off, Shomen.